Mike Schutzenhofer, Police Chief of Freeburg, and welcome to our new addition. Uh, we still have some concrete work that we have to get done, but uh, with the great board members that we have in the village of Freeburg, they were uh, able to make this dream come true for us. Uh, one of the nice things that we're going to have here is this garage area here is what they call a sally port. Uh, so when an officer has a prisoner, they'll be able to drive up, they'll have a garage door opener, opens up and they'll transport the guy inside, door closes, a lot more safety for the guys and for the prisoners. So now we're inside the sally port. Um, eventually we'll have a dog kit on here for all the, uh, the dogs that we get that uh, run at large um, and they'll be secured inside here. Once they're in here, then they, uh, this first door is our entrance into the hallway. And then the back door there is the entrance into the booking room. So I'll take you inside there. So inside we're in the booking room. So once the officer, if they have an arrest, they'll escort them through this door. Uh, eventually there'll be a bench here where the uh, prisoner will uh, be seated. Uh, the officer will be able to do all the necessary paperwork that he needs to be done, that needs to be done. Uh, interviews will be uh, done in here as well. We have uh, audio and video recording system in here. Um, also, we have a restroom where we're not transporting them up front near the secretary uh, for safety issues. Uh, with this being camera, uh, in the bathroom in here, there is a, a part on the screen that exits the, uh, the restroom out, so they're not exposed. So now we're in the locker room for the guys. Um, lockers are very nice. Um, Plenty of room for the officers to store their uniforms, uh, extra storage at top to put whatever they need to, and the nice thing is storage down at the bottom. Um, had a very good person that uh, got us a deal on these um, 12 lockers and we paid a dollar. I know you know who you are. Thank you very much and the officers here at Trevor Police Department really appreciates it. Uh, also, the nice thing that we have in here also is we have a shower. Um, so, guys get exposed to anything, they're able to come here and get cleaned off and not taking it home to their families. Uh, a lot of guys will work out before they uh, come to work. They get cleaned up, uniforms are here, ready to go. And then in the back door, uh, is the uh, the restroom area. With this next room and this big opening is our evidence room. Uh, there will be a series of shelving and everything in here. This great big opening there will be uh, a built-in locker that sits flush against the wall. There will be different sizes and shapes of lockers in here for the officers so whenever they get evidence they get it in the correct packing slip and everything they'll bring it in here secure it in a locker. Then the evidence officer will buzz his way in and remove it out of the locker, log it in to what shelf it's going to be going to. So this is very huge for us and going to make things a lot better. And in this room here is uh, another office. Uh, hopefully down the road in the future uh, we'll be able to promote some guys to sergeants and they'll have a, a workplace. But right now we have it temporary set up. We do have a computer here. For the officers whenever um, all our accidents are done on a computer now um, so when they get back here they have to uh, get on this computer to do their diagram and then it, everything's uh, ready for the state so we're pretty much almost 100 percent uh paperless here at the uh, freeburg police department so the nice thing that we have here also is a basement uh, concrete walls as well as the ceilings all concrete also, during the day, if we have uh, bad weather, tornadoes, or whatever, uh, our staff here at the office will definitely be secure. Uh, down here will be storage. Uh, we're getting uh, shelving and everything and making the police department bigger and better.